guys, welcome back. Today is gonna be a long day. We've uh, been out here for a while already. We got back from the hardware store. It's me and Jose right now. Here's what we're doing first. So first thing up, we're gonna replace this fence. Clearly, as you can see, it's falling down. Um, these are old, old panels that we got uh, for free from some companies that do that do fences. If you contact them, they will bring you free fence panels because they can charge the customer for hauling them away and then they just drop them off at your place for free. It's a great way to put up mazes and stuff. But anyway, we're gonna take these down. Um, for years, we have used these like quick set, um, they're kind of like a spike that goes in the ground and holds onto a fence post. You can see one right here, kind of like that. Um, they don't hold great. So we're going to take these this off. We're actually going to put the fence post concreted into the ground. Um, today we're gonna do the posts only because it's pretty fucking windy out here. And I don't want, until it's they're fully cured, I don't want them to like blow over or something. So we're going to take this out and then start to line up our holes and auger our holes for the posts. Let's do it. All right, guys, we're making pretty good progress. Um, it's been a few hours. We had to go back to the hardware store. Um, we'll have to go back again to take some of this concrete back. I feel like we do this every time where we like over um the concrete so i always expect to do like two bags for each post but one bag at two feet like fills the hole so you've got eight more bags of concrete that need to go back but here's progress so we got that other fence uh taken down the posts are here we got to clean these up we took the panels over there so we can use them for containment got all these up squared everything so we're gonna let these cure overnight so they get a good 20, 24 hour cure and then the next day we're here we'll put the panels on um, which they're just right there on the trailer we'll get those on we'll have to get a coat of paint on them but it's pretty fast with the, uh, the paint sprayer that way they don't get screwed up from age uh, with, with the rain and stuff but we're uh, let these cure I am going to on this hose we got around the rest of the building here it's over there so we can hook it up to the hose reel and then we can have our 100 150 foot hose to stretch out and go all the way across all that i essentially have this one stretched in here um, i'm going to run it along like the building pretty tight uh, the rest of the way around over here and the hose reel is going to go right here on the corner so that we can stretch stretch our hose out, spray off our whole deck, spray off our parking lot, all that good shit. So Jose's inside working on the plumbing. I'll show you that in just, just a minute. This won't take me very long. Jacob uh, just ran to get some sanding stuff to do the drywall work inside. So let's do it. All right, guys, update on the projects. So water lines are ran all the way across, through the wall, around the corner, down the block, through that wall, through this, down, under, across, down, and then we've got all of our, our T's for hooking into the sinks. Uh, the water heater is gonna go over here to get hot water to these and that one over there. Um, we have to get the proper fittings to go into the threads of these, um, so we'll get those connected and I'm not sure how Joe's connecting to the water heater itself. So also out here, uh, Jacob is wrapping up this drywall. He just put an, another top coat on it. So I think it just needs like some sanding. And then like once the stuff dries, needs some sanding and then it's ready for paint. So that's cool. So today we completed all the projects that we were planning to, the drywall, the water and the fence. And now we have one of our events tonight. We are going to Sky Zone, which is a trampoline park here in Northwest Indiana. We're gonna meet everyone out there. We're gonna go grab some food and then head there. Let's do it. All right, here we are, Sky Zone Indoor Trampoline Park. 
Let's check it out. This is in Cherville, so about 25 minutes or so from the hunt, um, like the next town over. But let's check it out. Um, at 8 o'clock is our event, and it's supposed to start like glow jump or something. I don't know. So should be kind of cool. That's Lori.
still got it.
Justin, catch a ball. 